All right friends, welcome back to another video on building multipurpose Laravel 9 and Vue 3 application. And in this video, I will show you how we can add pagination links over here. So we can switch to different pages, like if I click on 2, then we are on page 2 with these results. You can switch different pages and this is very instant, we are not refreshing the page anymore. And for this, we'll be using Laravel Vue pagination package and I will show you how we can install and use that package as well. So without further delay, let's get started adding this pagination links. So first of all, let's install this package. Let me go to installation and we'll be using npm. So let me copy it. npm install Laravel view pagination. Okay, this got installed. Now we can simply import this inside our component and use it. So we'll be using bootstrap for pagination and let me go to user list or view file let me go to the top and over here let me import that now let me go to bootstrap 4 components and from here let me copy this part as we are using bootstrap 4 pagination right so let me go to the end of the table and after this let me paste that let me indent it and for data we'll be getting those data from users dot data and on pagination change page uh, we'll be calling the method called get users right and we have already defined that method over here but we need to pass uh, page equals one is the initial argument and over here let me change this uri api slash users page equals the given page over here so if we click on page 2 then it will change to page 2 right this will still not work because we need to change the code inside of a user controller user controller and over here instead of calling the get method we need to call the paginate method and for now let's paginate just two results if i refresh this this is still not working let me let me open up the console and it is saying that cannot read properties of undefined reading meta so to fix this uh, we need to pass users of object instead of just users data in our pagination component over here so let me refresh it and we get this component but we are not getting those results so now to fix those instead of looping over the users we need to look over users data right and over here for the conditional as well we need to check the length of users dot data dot length and if i refresh it this is still not working let me open up the console again and it is saying that cannot read properties of undefined and to fix this so let me go to uh, users state uh, that we have defined users const users over here uh, instead of passing array let's pass object uh, with data as empty array now if i refresh it then that error got fixed let me close this and if i switch to different pages and we get those results which is perfect right so let's align this properly so let me go to bootstrap for pagination and instead of adding this component over here let me go outside of that box okay we save this and we have this pagination over here but there is one issue if i search for something then this is not working let me open up the console to see the error and it is saying the same error so we are using that separate method for search so we need to change over here as well so instead of calling that get method we need to call the paginate method so now if I refresh it, let me close this, I can search for David and this is working. You can switch to different pages and this is also working. And finally I can remove this as by default this will be 15. So, so if there are more than 15 users then that pagination link will appear automatically. If I refresh it and we do not see that link. But if our user are more than 15, then it, that pagination link will appear automatically. So this must for this video. I hope you learned something from this video. So don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel as I will be uploading the videos like this. So till then have a great time and I will see you on the next one.